Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Danny, and this video will be covering this question shown on screen. So the first step in order to solve this question is to isolate the square root, as you can see over here, and we're going to square it on both sides, which will cancel the square root on the left because you're doing the opposite. See, it cancels out, and we're going to be left with 9 on the right-hand side over here. Now, we have to understand there's an x over here. We could divide it and bring it onto the 9 side. So we did, did we do that. So we bring it to the other side, as you can see over here. This gets cancelled out. It's going to proceed to this. And now we have another square root. we got to do the exact same thing. We square on both sides, cancel it, and we square on this side. So yeah. And now we're left with this. Now we got to distribute the power of 2 inside. So we're going to have 81 and x squared. As you can see. And now we divide x on that side. So now we're going to be divided, uh, dividing it. And after this is going to equal to this, which we multiply it. This could be underneath 81 divided by x3 to the power of 3. Now we have... Um, Another square root, we do the exact same thing. We square on both sides and we square on over here too. So now this cancels out over here. We do 81 to the power of 2 and now x uh, to the power of 3 multiplied by 2. So we end up with this. We bring the x6 on the other side. As you can see over here. Okay, now we multiply it, then over here we do the, the, uh, the root of 7, so over here we do the root of 7, so we'll cancel out the 7, uh, x to the power of 7 over here, and we're going to be left with this, which if you put it inside your calculators, you're going to get an answer of 3.5097. So that's it for this video. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe and that's it. So hope you guys have a wonderful great day